All right, we fought, caught Gardner eating again. <laughs> yeah, we got a great rest stop here. How about all the shade that we got? Isn't this great? Thanks for being here for us. You're welcome. Enjoy it. Oh, yes, indeed. We're at Watson Mill Park. And I'm going to pan around here for a moment. And you can see nothing because I'm in the way of a tree. But I come down here, and you can see the covered bridge. And I'll get a shot a little bit closer in just a few moments, I hope. Yeah, this is the downhill that leads to the bridge. And so I'll show you the bridge really quick. It's hard to shoot a bridge because watch what happens. I walk in there and it's like the light at the end of the tunnel. So anyway, the rules say not to uh, ride through it, so I'm going to walk it this time. But meanwhile, you can take a look at the way it's made. And you can take a look at my tandem partner, and you can see the tandem is fixing to head down the hill, right? <laughs> now, are you holding on to it good? All right, well, we'll go ahead and move on after we get this shot here. And you can see it's just a really beautiful location. We've got pedal boats over there. We could make those fly, right? Yeah. And nobody's down playing on the rocks this year. And that's probably a good thing, because I remember when my friend Eric Carlson, he slipped on the rocks and got hurt and had to go home from Bragg. That was pretty sad. All right, well, here we go. Next, we've reached Deep Creek Baptist. And we're making good time. We got a dog here. What's the story on the dog? Raise a guide dog puppy, oh my goodness. Pretty cute, I bet he'll grow up to be somebody's friend. And it's Mama Raphael's lunch stop, so I'm gonna go chow down. We're starting to get some shade from up above, so maybe it won't be quite so hot. Hey, you guys, how's it going? Hey. All right, that's good. We made it to lunch before they close. I'm very proud of y'all. Really that is super. All right, we'll catch you later. Okay. And then we did it. I'm very pleased. It's 11:49, if I can believe my watch. I just want you to know I'm going to wash my hands before I touch anything. There you go. All right. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're in Dewey Rose. I guess you can see there are roses over there to one side. You can see the post office over there. And the railroad is here. I've got a little Dewey Rose store of some kind over there where my partner is waiting. But if you look, they're resurfacing the road, and it's so high that I'm going to walk the tandem over that. And I can't change. There we go. Yeah, see, it'd be like jumping a curb, and for a single bike, that'd be all right. Yo, yeah, well, stop sign. Watch out, that's a rough transition. Yeah, I'm glad they're watching. See, here comes a truck, and he's not going slow. All right, watch. Yes, yeah, so that'd be too rough on the tandem, at least with two people on it. But anyway, this is Dewey Rose here on State Route 17, the Bowman Highway. All right, let's continue. We got to another rest stop before it closed. I'm glad we did because it's the Georgia Guidestones. We found Winston, and he's right in front of the Jewish side of the Guidestones. And for those of you who can read Hebrew, there it is. Let me step out of the way here. <laughs> now, for those of us taking Spanish, we'll see if we can read the other side over there. Oh, wonderful. If I can get a copy of that from you, I might send it to Dr. Zavala. Oh, I'm sure he'll like that. Yeah. All right, here we go. So there's the Spanish for those of you who want to learn a little bit of new vocabulary. And I'll give you the translation in just a moment, except the translation's been a little vandalized. Okay, I cannot see if I'm getting this or not because the video finder, viewfinder is really hard to check. But on the bottom it says, be not a cancer on the earth, leave room for nature and leave room for nature. And somebody crossed it out and put jello. 
which I can't tell. Instead, I'm getting Cheryl in and her little friend there. All right. But anyway, they're still structurally good. Nobody's knocked them over. There's even a hole where you can look through and see other people. Now, actually, it, there's a reason for that. What do you think of this? Evan, what do you think of these? Nice and different languages. It's pretty strong. I hope it'll be here for a long time. That's some interesting stuff it says, but uh, definitely a monument to the ingenuity of the granite business in the area. The Godstones can be seen from a long way off because we're up pretty high here. Sure looks like it. You can see way off in the distance. And down here there's an explanation. And because of the lighting that we have here, I can't really tell what I'm getting. Perhaps I should switch viewfinders, but I'm too lazy. Alright, Stephen is trying to clean it's not gonna work, the dust right? out of the granite. I bet well, you they have a nice little sheet on it, though. Yeah, I'll have to Where's go back and play this capsule? back. Someone said there was a time capsule buried. I guess it's inside here, but why yeah. do they do that? Well, what does it mean? It I says, mean, says what is time capsule, capsule place? Yeah, it's pretty amazing. Oh, yeah. this spot this on, on to be open on. And it's oh, not it's filled not, in. Not wow, that's something else. And you mean they were going to try and blow it up? I think they're going to dig it up and see what's underneath here at, at that time, I guess. But there isn't a time, so. Yeah, that is weird. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, hang on. Now, when I was here last time, this was not here. And I don't, I can't tell if I'm getting the shot right or not. But if I am, put it on pause and read it. I'll scroll down a little bit, back off, and good luck. All right, well, we're going to go away from the mystery and get to the usual rest stop business. So here we go. No, it didn't take us this long to get here. Yet sunset, it's 10 minutes till 9. As we enjoy a late spring evening here in Elberton. And there's the REI tent way over there. But I chose this spot so I could get the sunset view. People are camped just about everywhere. And I'm again inside. I'm happy about that. Oh well, another year. I missed the talent show, but I'm, at least there are people here dancing. If they play any more music. But take a look around town. You can compare this with my older videos. I really don't remember this looking so nice. This is very good. Together downtown still looks pretty healthy. The park still looks very much the same. And who do we have here? Harry. Harry, it's good to see you. Thanks for holding my bike for me. Well, I'm glad you do. Maybe one day we can team up and you can try it and see what it's like. Yeah, let's be a stoker. <laughs> all right. Well, maybe we can work that out on the freight room ride. Oh, the freight room would be tough. We'd have to be shifting like truck drivers on that ride. I know you're here. Yeah. Yeah, you might you might do better than me at shifting this thing. But uh, so far it's been a good bike. But anyway, yeah, they're back to dancing again. Actually, a lot of them are leaving, and I better do that too because it's now 9.23. So I better head on back. All right. We'll see you later. Thanks for holding my bike for me. Here we go. Hey, Blake, can I get a picture of you? Well, good morning, Blake. How's it going? Tired. Yeah, I was quite the sleep last night here on the floor in the hallway here. Yes, we had our nightlight. Yeah, yeah, we had all, all these lights you see on now that were on all night. Well, anyway, it's great to see you again after all these years. Hope you have a great ride today. Yeah, 19 years ago. Yeah, it was pretty cool. All right, we'll see you around. All right, bye. Bye. Okay, before we go, Here's what we did yesterday. 
and the average was actually better than that because I rode around town. Okay, that's it. Look who's holding my bike for me. I'm very grateful. You're now, welcome. Cody finished up riding with me yesterday. Did a great job. And now it's Ratanja's turn. Ratanja, you all ready? Yes. All right, I'm almost ready. I got to get the seat the correct height and put the map on board and put some sunblock on and visit one of those uh, portable restrooms over there and then we'll be ready. All right. All right, well, here we go. Okay. We're in Middleton, Georgia. Just a little store here, not too much else. And railroad crossings. Winston's got a call. He's got to go back and check on his mom. But we're glad we he got to ride this far with us. Riders are coming down the hill. We've been losing more altitude than we've been gaining. All right, looking good, y'all. All right. Well, anyway, we'll finish up this shot. Maybe we can, I don't know, I don't think we quite qualify for that. Move on. Well, we're at the quick stop. It's kind of unusual from, to have a rest stop at a store, but that's what they're doing. And we're still hanging in there and doing pretty well, I'd say. It's a pretty country around here. It's not so hilly now. We're really enjoying that. I bet you can guess whose bike this is. Where's Dick Alice? <laughs> he can't be too far away. All right, they've been mixing up some more Powerade and I've got to get some of that. So I'm gonna drink the water and replace it with Powerade. It's nice to have some shade and we sure got it here. I'm sorry, we sure got it here at this rest stop. We're at the Nancy Hart State Park. How's it going, y'all? Great. Well, I'm real happy to hear that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll turn the camera away where you adjust things. <laughs> yeah, they had a nice shady spot for us back there. No problem parking the bike. So, I wish we could stay longer. We'll have to come back and check this place out a little bit more, but Nancy Hart sounded like she was a pretty special lady. Revolutionary War hero. So, let me get on that Santana and make it go. No, excuse me. Let us get on the Santana and make it go. <laughs> All right, here we go. Once again, the guide dog, the future guide dog, has made a lot of friends. Is that, is that a guide dog? Uh, really? It's amazing guide dog. That's what the dog yeah. needs. the thingy on the top. What is a little toy that the dog has? Yeah. Um, I think it's a rope. Yeah, it's a rope with knots. From that side, it looked like a small model of a Shih Tzu. <laughs> it's a real shaggy dog and you can't hardly see its face. It's like a mop on legs. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so do you all have dogs? Do you have a dog? Yeah. You have a dog? I don't have a dog. I have two frogs. They're exotic. You have, oh, you have we frogs. Have two fish too. What'd you have? Yeah, that's what I have. <laughs> who's, whose job is it to take care of the fish? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's not good. You know, we had we had some goldfish that lasted for years and years in a bowl, and I can't believe it lasted that long. My doggy's in doggy heaven, though. And I still miss him. Every day I miss him. Wow. I mean, yeah. Wow. That's probably why I want to get me another one like that. I want this one. Did you say he wanted to go home with me? No, I said. Wow. Well, that's a good shot, man. I appreciate everybody. I see the absolutely not. And you, young man. All right. <laughs> 